What's up, y'all, and welcome back to another vlog, y'all. So, thank you for tuning in, first of all. Let me just go ahead and thank you, give the gratitude, give you all the thank yous, okay, okay, okay. So, welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new, welcome back, welcome back, welcome, welcome, welcome. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But y'all, I'm excited. As you can see, I'm excited. I don't know why the light keep changing. Let me do this. But y'all, it is my first day of work. I got my first client today. Now granted, the first client is my sister, okay? It's my sister. In the shop, actually. My first client in the shop. So I'm super excited and I don't know what's weird. I just got off my nine to five job. You know, I'm trying to quit that job. I'm trying to make this a full time job, but I don't know what to wear. I wanted to get like a custom shirt with my logo and like my name, licensed esthetician or something on there. I need some chapstick y'all. I'm, this is getting on my nerves. Okay, I'm back. I got some chapstick on. But yeah, it's my first day and I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. I don't know, my skin has been peeling so bad. I'm so sorry if I'm here and then there, but my skin has been peeling so bad since I've been back from Mexico. <laughs> like even on my face, like I just peeled that off. That's why it's red. Like my face, like I had a, I don't know, it was on my nose and it was like a, like a dry patch and then it's like started peeling and that's how the same thing was here and I just like peeled it off and it I guess it was like a scab I don't know anyways y'all I don't know what to wear Brandon was like maybe you should wear your scrubs but my scrubs is not the same color as my theme and I'm like it's just my sister I'm not gonna put anything fancy on but then again I'm like maybe I need to get into the mood of actually you know getting cute not cute but you know getting my life together for work i want to be presentable i don't want to just go in there with some sweatpants on and tank top you know i really don't know what to wear you guys i probably am gonna wear let me see sorry for the lighting change but we are in the closet so um actually i think i am just gonna wear my scrubs i think i'm just wear my scrubs just for this one time and like i said the scrubs are not even the color that I need them to be. I don't know where my black shirt is. But these are my scrubs that I have from school. I had to get burgundy scrubs. Anyway, um, what was I saying? So yeah, I had to get these scrubs for school. I think I'm just gonna throw them on because... But I don't know where my black shirt is. Like my black shirt I used to wear underneath of it. Which I would rather wear than a full scrub outfit because I'm not... I'm not going to the hospital. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm not going to the hospital, so. You know, I think, I think I'm gonna have to go shopping, y'all. I think I'm gonna have to go shopping. Should I just wear this gray tank top with my scrub pants? Because I don't know where that black shirt is. Oh, is this it? This is it, this is it, this is it. Okay, found a black shirt. And it's a black long sleeve and it'd be freezing in my office or in my shop. So it's real fitting to have long sleeves on. So yeah, I'm gonna wear this and I'm gonna wear my black Crocs cause I could do that. I could do that. I could really wear whatever the hell I want. But like I said, I wanna get into the hang of getting professional for work, like getting into my work clothes. You feel me? Like I wanna be presentable when I go to work. So yeah, let's do this. Let's do this real quick. All right, so get your life together, girl. Get your life together. That's what I used to hate about this black shirt. It used to get so freaking linty. I had to carry a lint brush to school every day because like, girl, no. So Heather actually bought me this for, it was like a gift for my grand opening and it's purple, y'all. It's like a lavender purple. And I think this is gonna be my work bag. So I'm gonna take all this stuff out of here, pack me. This lighting, y'all, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna pack up my stuff that I'm gonna bring to the shop in here. And it's just gonna be my work bag. Now I need to, um, I'm gonna just put on some these socks that I had on yesterday when I went to my mama's house. It's just these, um, <laughs> they're holiday socks. Hey Arnold is on there. And I'm gonna just put them on 
because I don't feel like going through that drawer. And I need some new socks. Like, I don't like wearing socks at all. I don't know, I've just never been a sock person. So when it's time to wear socks, I'm like, oh God, now I gotta go find some damn socks to put them on. And I like these socks because they're like cute. You know what I'm saying? They're cute. They got Hey Arnold on us, my dude. Okay. My sister got these for me like a couple years ago. Should I put my Apple Watch on just to, just to, just for the razzle dazzle of it? It's dead, but they ain't gotta know that. They ain't gotta know that, okay? I'm not gonna wear my bracelets because that's not professional at all. There's my earrings, get me a little stud action going on. Get me some studs. Nothing too shiny, nothing too fancy. So I really didn't even check to see what kind of um, facial she wanted. I think she booked the um, signature one. She wants extractions. Like I have two different facials. I have a basic facial, which is just like a basic cleanse. Like I'm gonna wash your face and you gonna go. <laughs> and I got the signature cleanse, which is like extractions. You get the cooling globes. You get a mask, like a, a cute mask. You know, you get a real deep cleanse. You know, all of that. You get the whole shebang with the sh the signature. And hopefully she'll let me do some footage on her. If not, then oh well. Because she, she don't even like being on camera like that. Y'all, my braids are still hitting. They, they itchy though. They real itchy. They still cute though. That girl did her thing. So if y'all in Jacksonville and y'all need somebody to do your hair, braid your hair up. Now mind you, these is me length. Small, knotless braids. If you don't like sitting in the chair for 10 hours, then don't even don't even think about it. But yeah, she did a real good job, y'all. She did her thing. Like it's been almost three weeks and my hair is like, it's not even, you see what I'm saying? It's not even shabby. And she didn't even have to cut, like you know how you have to cut the hair? You know what I'm saying? You know you have to cut it up and make sure like the, the dead ends or whatever it is, is not poking out. She didn't even have to do that. So for it to be like this, you know what I'm saying? real good it's a little flaky up here but that's because i've been scratching it but it still looks great it still looks so good but anyway let me pack my bag so we can go so i also um yeah i'm looking a little different i just put my hair up but i also come on lighting get it together what what setting are we on goodness but anyway i also printed out um my intake form my client intake form i'm gonna just have her fill it out so I can get the hang of doing this. Like my friend Heather, she has like this website that she uses for hers, like where you have to go online and do it online instead of like printing out the paper. But that costs money and I don't know if I wanna spend the money on that right now. Like maybe if I get more clients, I don't know, I'm gonna have to figure it out. But, and so as an esthetician, you when you do on facials and stuff, you gonna be all up on people. So you can't really have too many fragrances on. But this one is from Bath and Body Works. It's called Cozy Sunday, uh, Sunday morning. And it's like a very, very, very light scent. You can barely even smell it when you leave the house type stuff. But I like to just spray myself down. Just one spray, not no like you putting on a whole bunch of perfume. Ain't nobody got time for that. Like I said, as an esthetician, you're gonna be in people's face, like in their face area. And some people are sensitive to smell, so. You gotta be mindful of that. Okay, so I think I have sheets up there. I do have sheets up there. I got towels, but I did have towels that I needed to wash. So hopefully I have enough towels up there. My friend had bought me some new towels. No, Kayla actually. My sister actually bought me some new towels and I think they're at her house. So I'm gonna see if they cleaned them yet. And if they did, we can bring those with us. Okay. But yeah, y'all, I'm about to, um. Text my sister and let her know I'm ready to go. Oh, actually, before I do that, I'm gonna print the other paper. Cause I was like, wait a minute, maybe I could do two-sided. Cause this is only one-sided. And instead of using all this paper, I can put, you know, put it on one page, you know, front back type. Sh this camera is really playing with me. I had to change the setting to manual. I don't usually use manual, I don't think. I don't know, but the, the coloring was, Pissing me off. Y'all look at my background. Ooh, you already know, Lux B. I had to print four extra pages. Oh Lord. But all right, y'all. Let me text her and tell her I am ready so we can get to work down there. I need to bring my steamer. It said it needs, see, it feels like it's so dark in here. 
My steamer said it needs tap water when you first use it because I've never used this steamer. And good thing she is my first client. I could just test it on her. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna use tap water, but I also have um, the baby water. What, what kind of water that is? Forgot what it is. I got the water downstairs, so I need to pack that up in one of my recycle bags and then I'm gonna be ready to go. But yeah, let me go get the rest of these papers and then I will see y'all at the shop. Oh, I need to make sure I got my key because y'all, I went to Heather's grand opening and forgot my damn key and I was supposed to have a client the next day, which was Brandon, my best friend. But I was supposed to bring stuff up there and after I realized I didn't have my key, I was just so annoyed I canceled his appointment because I would have to get up dumb early just to get down to my shop and set up and all of that. And I, I didn't want to do that. That's why I went the day before. But anyway, hold on. Have my own fragrance. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going I'm to just burn my own fragrance because that's what you do. You, you burn your own stuff so that way when people be like, oh, what that's, what's that smell? You be like, oh, that's Luxby. <laughs> Go ahead and copy some. Go ahead and pick out which one you want because I got them in the shop so you can go ahead and bring it home with you tonight okay but anyway um do I need some I'm gonna guess I'm gonna bring some business cards with me I'm getting some new business cards they on the way on the way as we speak they've been shipped out I can't wait to show y'all that I made some flyers y'all and I'm so pissed off because <laughs> listen I got a typo on my flyer my my IG name is a whole typo and I'm like how the hell did I miss that so anyway and I got like 50 of them flyers all right y'all I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get to the shop all right y'all so I made it to the shop and that's why I like that my sister booked with me for my first client so I can get a feel of how everything is so since she wants her legs stomach arms and all of that wax and a facial I'm gonna have to move some of this stuff around to make it make sense. So this has to move over here to be closer to me, especially since I'm right-handed. So I need to be grabbing from over here. You know what I'm saying? Um, I like this little area because it was like fitting so perfectly out of the way because over here you have, you know, all of that going on. I didn't want it to be right there, but it's gonna have to be right there because that makes sense so yeah let me move this stuff around and i need to put some tap water in here i'm gonna turn it on until the water runs out and then i'm gonna put the regular distilled water in there and yeah we're gonna just work it out just work it out I kind of like dim the lights a little bit. Oh, I'm sorry, sister. But uh, I dim the lights a little bit. I'm getting ready. I'll go over everything else after this. But I wanted to show y'all that I got an order. Got an order. So uh, my sister's friend actually ordered um, a candle, two lips, uh, lip moisturizers, and a lip scrub. So I'm just going to package that up while I wait for the wax pot to heat up. I'm gonna do her waxing first and then I'll do the facial. Um, but I'll show y'all how I set up everything later after I finish packaging this up. So yeah. So I'm just going to show you my little setup that I came up with and then uh, I'm going to go ahead and do my sister's wax. She's getting her legs waxed, half a leg, and then she wants the signature facial like I told y'all. 
but let me show you how it's set up. So I got this card from Goodwill, as you can see, I still got the tag on it, but got this from Goodwill because I knew I was gonna need it one day. I put my wax pot on it and then it has these drawers. I'm missing one for some reason. I don't know where it's at, but yeah. So I just put my dental bibs inside the drawers because I don't have, I was gonna use my lash cart, but I have lash stuff on it. So I'm not about to take all that stuff off. So what I did was just put the dental bibs inside the drawers and then put whatever I need for the service in the drawers. So when she's getting the wax, I put some wax sticks, of course my gloves and a few of the aesthetic wipes. So that way I can cleanse remove the extra wax or whatever. So that's in the first drawer. And then the second drawer, um, I have some more gloves, of course. I have all my clean implements, some more aesthetic wipes. I have my dirty implement um, whole container there. So when I'm done with the clean ones, they'll be dirty, so I'll put them in there. And I have some sponges. So that's that. And then I just have up here set up the wax cleanser. I have remover. I have some powder. We're probably not going to need the powder because that's usually for underarms. And then I have some aloe vera gel. So I have that sitting up there. And then over here for her facial, I have the products that I'm going to be using for um, her skin. She does have oily skin, she likes to say. I'm gonna be using some skin script products and I have a image cleanser that I'm gonna use. So yeah, that's just my little setup. I got my um, lip moisturizer there. But yeah, that's how I'm gonna have it set up. And I got the lights dimmed down. I got my sign on over there. And then I have my, my light here that can dim down. So yeah, yeah, I'm about to just go ahead and start her waxing. So she ready for your leg wax? Let's go. camera actually died when I was doing my sister's facial but yeah so I gotta figure out what is going on with my wax because when I was waxing her I think I know what's going on but when I was waxing her the wax was getting super hard like it was getting hard quick and so what I think it is is the temperature in the room is not 
align with the temperature of the wax basically like the wax is fine but when it's like when it gets out of the pot it gets hard super quick so i don't know what i'm gonna do about that i think i um i had seen on like i had googled it and that's pretty much what somebody had said it's because of the temperature in your room and outside basically what she suggested was to turn your wax pot up more but i kind of don't want to do that because it's gonna probably burn my clients you know what i mean like if i try to like cool it down it's still gonna get hard i feel like i don't know i don't know so i'm gonna have to figure that out but right now i'm about to clean up because last time that i was here I didn't clean my um, utensils because it was late when I left here. It was like 9.30. So I'm just clean that real quick, clean the bed, and what else I wanted to do? Oh, do some like content in here before I go. Hi. Okay, this, that's weird. The little girl literally just <laughs> looked in my room because the door is like halfway frosted, but it's not all the way frosted. Let me show you. She keeps looking in here. <laughs> so it's halfway frosted, so she'll bend down and like look through here. Okay, so yeah, um, let me clean up real quick. Through drought and famine, natural disasters, my baby is been those utensils and put stuff away but I wanted to show y'all a gift that I got I got a lot of gifts but I already put some of it away I think I'm gonna do like a separate video for the stuff that I got for my registry for my grand opening um yeah I'll definitely do a separate video because I got a lot of stuff a lot of good stuff but something that I have right now that I got yesterday let me show y'all my friend which is Heather's friend which is she's still my friend too because we all used to work together y'all and so um she had bought me a mug oh i cannot wait to show you how the mug it's so cute it's a coffee cup and then she bought me this which is um i think <sighs> y'all i went on to my amazon and i just checked to see who not who purchased what but what was purchased and the last thing that was purchased was this thing 
And I'm like, girl, you didn't even have to do all of that because this thing was kind of expensive. It was like $60. But this is a, um, a bed warmer. So I'm super excited to put this on the bed. Y'all gonna help me put it on the bed or whatever. And sorry if it sounds like I'm whispering, whispering because I kind of am because there are other estheticians in this building and there's one literally across from me and I seen somebody in there so I don't want to be talking loud even though the lady down the street with the um, boutique, she had people down there and a whole bunch of kids running back and forth being loud. I'm like people come here to you know get services but there are estheticians who perform facials and like don't be wanting all that ruckus you know what I'm saying? Anyway, I can't even get this open. She must be having a grand opening or something because I see people bringing like um, ice and like bags and stuff down there. And she has a big old balloon garland thing by her door. So I don't know. Hey, look y'all. Gosh. Okay, here it is. It's basically just a heating pad, a big old heating pad that you could put on your, your bed. So I'm super excited. So I'm gonna put this on first and then I have my bolster that I'm gonna put on top of it. And then I'm gonna put the sheets on top of all of that. So yeah, maybe I shouldn't put the sheets on yet cause I wanna test it out. Test out the warmer just to make sure it, it works before I put brand new sheets on there. Yeah, y'all, let me do that. I got the brand new sheets right here. I just took the wrapping off. And I get my sheets from Target. They're only like 10 bucks for twin size sheets that fit the um, table or whatever. I had like four of these in school. I gave one to my friend. Cause I'm like, I'm not gonna need this. Girl, yes, I do need these. I only have, I have like three. Yeah, I have three now. Cause I bought four and I gave one away. Yeah, instead of me washing all these sheets all the time, I could just have backups, you know what I'm saying? So I'll probably get some more of these sheets. I love these, cause I had got some from, I think it was Walmart or Amazon. I think it was Amazon, but it was so like cheap and thin, like it wasn't soft, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, anyway, let me um put this on here. Ooh, got the remote. Oh, there is a um, little thing down here where you can put the remote on the bed. That's cute. But yeah, if y'all wanna um, purchase something from me, definitely hit up Luxby Shop, theluxbyshop.com. I got scrubs, candles, lip moisturizers, uh, lip scrubs, we got bath salts, we got lash, um, la what is it? <laughs> lash bath for your lashes. We got sunglasses. I'm thinking about doing like a thrift, like a Luxby thrift, like of all my, not old, but like my clothes that I don't even wear no more or have tags still on them. So I'm thinking about adding that to my website instead of doing Poshmark. Because Poshmark be trying to tax and add shipping charges that are crazy. So I think I'm gonna just put them on my site, but I'll let y'all know if I do that. But anyway, um, if y'all do wanna get me something for the shop, my Amazon link is down below. So I appreciate y'all if y'all do in advance and make sure you leave a gift note so I can shout, shout y'all out whenever I do get a gift because a lot of the gifts that I got didn't come with um, the gift note. So, all right, so this is super exciting. extension cord only has three plugs and then two usbs but i need more than that so i can fit all my cords on here like there's no plugs on this purple wall there's a plug over here by the wax pot and there's a plug right underneath my certificates but my lash cart is there and it's like i don't want to have cords every which way you know what i'm saying i gotta figure that gotta figure out what i can do for that but just for the sake of testing this, I want to see if it warms up, see if it, you know, works. I'm going to just unplug something for now and plug this up to see if it works. And like I said before, bed, it has like a little thing you can put stuff in. 
Um, like if they wanted to put their phone in there or like that, I'm gonna have them put their shoes in their clothes or whatever else belongings they have. If they, if they wanted to put their um, phone in the pocket, they can or they can leave it with their stuff. This did come with the bed and I just put the remote inside that pocket as well. But let's see, let's turn it on. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. How many levels? Okay, they got, oh, they got, okay, they got, ooh. Okay, they got six levels. We're gonna turn it up to six, just to see. And they got a timer, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. I don't know how high it goes up to, but I'll just put it on six minutes to see. I'm super excited. So shout out to her for getting me this, cause it was like a little penny, okay? It was a little piece of penny to get this. And um, I'm grateful for this because it is freezing in here. I'm gonna have to leave this jacket in here at all times because it is so freaking cold. I don't know why they got the air on blast, like super blast. I'm gonna just wait till it warms up and then I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna, Well, I'm not show y'all, but I'm gonna tell y'all how it feels, if it even works. <laughs> all right, so I'm back and the bed is warming up, but I thought it would be faster warming it up. I don't know why I thought that because it's brand new. So probably got time. Got to take time to um, break it in or whatever. But it is getting warm. I want to push this all the way up, but it's not going to reach in the pocket. And yeah, it should be fine. Ooh, it's warm. This is what it looks like. And it's so soft. So, so, so soft. Oh yeah, it's, it's definitely warm right here. And my dad had went to the Goodwill the other day and he found like these faces and they have like um, like diamonds or something on the bottom of them and he asked me if I wanted them. Hold on. He asked me if I wanted them. I said yeah because I could probably put them up at the top of these shelves because it just looks plain up there. I need something to go up there. But I don't know what to put in the vases. But this is what it looks like. It looked like it could have been a part of a wedding centerpiece or something but... I like it because of the diamonds, because you know Lux B is luxury beauty, so luxury, diamonds, all of that glam stuff. This thing was $14.99 originally, just a little piece. And this is a small one. I got two small ones and two large ones. Yeah, I'm gonna, I probably need to wash these out or something. I don't know, but I'm just gonna sit them up here on the counter for now until I figure out what I'm gonna do with them. But they're so pretty, aren't they? So there's a small one at my mom's house. I don't know why they didn't just leave it in my car, but um, there's a small one at my mom's house. So I gotta go get that, but this is the taller one. Yeah, and this one was $17.99 originally. I don't know how much he paid. Oh, he paid $1.99 for these. Oh yeah, that's cute right there. Shoot, that's cute right there. I might still put them up there though. I don't know, we'll see. These people getting on my nerves. You hear how loud they are? Like, there's two esthetician suites right here. So why are y'all being dumb loud? Granted, I ain't got no customer right now. But still, you got kids running up and down the hall, laughing, giggling. Look, she's sitting right in front of my door. Like, what are y'all doing? Yeah, um, I ain't saying I don't like kids, but don't be touching my door and doing all of that. Like, I'm annoyed now. I'm gonna have to pack up my stuff and go because I'm just like, I can't, I can't. They're literally running up and down and then they're like standing in front of the door. I would show y'all them, but I don't wanna put nobody's kids on my camera. Like, the little baby is cute, but. <sighs> All right, I'm annoyed. Okay, y'all, so I am back home and I got dressed because, well, first of all, I wanted to wash my car today, but the weather is just not giving what it's supposed to give. Well, I knew it was supposed to rain today, but I still wanted to wash my car because it's like so freaking dirty, y'all. Like, it's so dirty. Like, I don't never have my car like that. I swear I haven't washed my car in like three months. And I don't never do that because uh, my car is the family Uber and, and Toro car. Like, I got my car in Toro for the family. <laughs> and 
nobody washes my car and I, I didn't go wash my car either because every time I try to go, it either rains or somebody else has my car. So yeah, I, that's out the window. So I came home. Well, I wanted to go to the UPS store, which I did return some Am Amazon packages. But you know how usually you go to the, um, the store and you don't have to package anything up. You don't have to get no label, none of that. So I went to the store thinking I had to do that because I've never had to do that. And I get to the store, I'm looking at the email. I'm like, where is the code? Where is the code? So I go into the app and they was like, oh, we sent you a label to print out and put in your package and do it. I was like, you know what? This is crazy. I have until the 24th send that stuff off and today is the 21st so i got a couple days and i think they're closed tomorrow so i'm gonna try to do it when i get off of work on monday like asap because they close at five the one over here by me closes at five and i get off at 4 30 so i'm gonna have to rush over there it's not too far but you know traffic people already getting off of work around that time so i don't know but anyway so today is my nephew no he's not my nephew but he's my nephew He's my little cousin, Kanai. Y'all seen him on the vloggy vlogs. But today is his 13th birthday and I can't believe how old he is. Y'all, I was going through my stuff looking for something for the house and a picture of him, like a baby picture of him that I took like mad long ago fell out of my stuff. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna show it to y'all when I get in there. But I was gonna do my makeup, y'all. But I cannot find my makeup brushes for nothing. Like for nothing. And so I was debating with myself whether I should put makeup on or not. So I'm taking this as a sign that I shouldn't put makeup on because I cannot find them brushes whatsoever. I don't know where them brushes went. Like honestly, I can't even do no kind of makeup, like none. I mean, I probably could, but um, hold on, let me show you this picture of him. Look at baby Kanai, oh my gosh. I took this picture back in my photography days when I, when I was into photography, but I don't even know how old he was. He probably had to been like two. I think he was like two here. I can't even remember. I'm gonna have to ask my aunt. He's gonna be so cute, my stinky little baby. But he's about to be 13. Well, he's 13 today and I just cannot believe it. Like 10 years went by since this picture. Like 11 years went by since this picture. Like, y'all, I'm old as hell. <laughs> I'm old, but yeah. So we're going to Dave & Buster's for his birthday today because he loves Dave & Buster's. He don't never want to do nothing else. He don't never want for nothing for his birthday. So we're gonna get together and go to Dave & Buster's um, to celebrate. Like he don't even like cake or nothing. So I'm just like, okay, can I, whatever. But um, since I'm not doing my makeup, like I literally do not know where my brushes are. And I know they're not in here because I already went through this bag when I was emptying it out. Like I was, I really don't know where the brushes are and it's pissing me off. I found all my makeup and I know it ain't in here. I know it ain't in here. No, cause it's all my makeup. This is the makeup. I just don't know where the brushes are. And I know I took them back from Mexico. So I packed up all my stuff. So anyway, I'm about to sit here and edit some of these videos because y'all do not judge me. Y'all probably seeing this. <laughs> y'all probably seeing this like way after it was filmed. Way after. So I'm about to sit here and edit some pictures, like not pictures, but um, some videos or whatever. And um, just wait until it's time to go for this birthday party. I gotta go pick up my mom and my sister and then head to my grandmother's house and get them. So I'll see y'all later. <laughs> so I'm at grandma's house and I got Kanai some balloons. Is it blurry y'all? If it is blurry, I can't fix it right now cause I got my hands full. Oh, there it goes. I got him some balloons and a card and my mom is getting him a gift card. She's on her way, but I'm gonna go in here and bring him this and then we're gonna go to Dave and Buster's.
Yeah. Say cheese. Can I? You look so grown. Cheese. It's a video. <laughs> All right, y'all ready? Yeah, yeah, like, hey, let's do it. Let's go already. Happy yeah. birthday to you. Happy birthday to oh. you. you. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Kanai. Happy birthday to you. Go ahead, Grandma. Yay! And many more. Happy birthday! 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 So thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed because I got more vlogs coming. But I will see you in the next one. Bye.